I asked them to take a poem and hold it up to the light like a color slide, or press it near against its hive. I say drop a mouse into a poem and watch him pull his way out, or walk inside the poem's room and feel the walls for a light switch. I want them to water ski across the surface of a poem, waving at the author's name on the shore. But all they want to do is tie the poem to a chair with rope and torture a confession out of it. They begin beating it with a hose to find out what it really means. The poem should be chosen because this poem contains many different literary devices such as imagery, simile, and personification. Some imagery and introduction to poetry are very detailed and lets the reader clearly see the image. For example, the phrase water ski on a poem's surface shows the image very clearly. Also, the phrase drop a mouse into a poem and watch him probe his way out shows clearly that they are dropping a mouse into a maze and watch him find the end of the maze. The title Introduction to Poetry shows that the author who is the speaker of the poem wants to introduce how the author expects you to understand poetry. The significance of the poem's structure is that the poetry is free verse and it is a lyric poetry. Lyric poetry is when the poem expresses personal feelings and emotions. This poem is trying to express the author's personal feeling about how he wanted the readers to read. The theme of the poem is that the author is trying to tell the readers that when they are reading the poems, they should enforce the meaning out of the poem and understand the feelings. The tone of this poem is disappointment from the author to the readers because the readers aren't reading the poem the way the author wants. As the poem said, they are trying to force the meaning out of the poem, which is not the correct way of interpreting them.